Flutter and Dart are asynchronous by nature. Dart's features enables you to manage I.O. without worrying about threads or deadlocks. For example, loading data from outside your app takes time. And features allow Dart to work on other tasks until the requested data is available. Great. But how do you build Flutter widgets when a future's involved? Enter Future Builder, the builder for handling, uh, futures. Future Builder lets you easily determine the current state of a future and choose what to show while the data is loading and when it's available. Start by giving Future Builder a future. But wait, you don't want to create the future inside of the Future Builder. As this code stands, the data fetching will restart every time the Future Builder's parent is rebuilt. Instead, obtain the future earlier on, like within a widget lifecycle method. So create a new state variable and move this data fetching request out of Future Builder and into init state. From there, we'll give it a builder. But make sure to check the state of the future with connection state and display an appropriate widget while your future's busy. Finally, it's good practice to check that no errors occurred while your future was resolving. There are other connection states you can use too. For more info on Future Builder and all the other Flutter widgets, head to flutter.dev.